and we've got a very special guest with us. Sundance Wicks, the brand new coach of the Green Bay men's basketball team. He was a uh, uh, named men's head coach on Tuesday. Congratulations, sir. Thank you, it's an honor to be here. I, the Green Bay, man, what a, what a treat. I came in today, I think it was snowing, then it was raining, and then it was snowing again. So <laughs> it's, not, it's my type of weather. Yeah, now tell me a little bit about the last few days. You were named head coach on Tuesday, but you haven't had much of a chance to, to, to see the campus or the community yet. No, this is like the, the show First 48, all right? You're just trying to find out where all the bodies are buried. And uh, you say, it, 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 it's like drinking water out of a fire hose right now, Ted. Well, we know that uh, you're a guy that's in pretty good shape. They introduced <laughs> you at the first time out here, and you went and gave everybody a high five in the building. You, you had to get this row and that row. <laughs> I mean, great energy. What, what, did, what did that mean to, you have, that, to have that reaction here when, uh, when they introduced you? I, I just know that this fan base and this community is starving for that, right? They just want something to connect to. And I... I I just I, the t the players we're going to bring in the type the style of play that we're going to we're going to put on the floor uh, is going to be a connecting style. I want uh, you know the Green Bay Way has always been about sharing the basketball, being able to play great team basketball. But the Green Bay Way is also about connecting with the community uh, and making sure that they feel ownership in everything that we do. Uh, and so for me, just to show a little bit of love to this community, for them to show the love that I, that I've received, uh, I always tell people you don't have to be from Wisconsin to understand Wisconsin values. Uh, that's hard hat lunch pail and making sure that you go meet them on their terms absolutely of course uh, the Phoenix program in a tough situation right now you take over a program where do you begin rebuilding this I know a lot of the fans wondering where, where what's number one thing that you have to do at this point well one you, you got to assess the state of the program right which isn't hard to do right now to know where we're at uh, there's nowhere to go but up uh, but from that is you have to you have to get to the competing side of things again uh, everybody wants to talk about winning, but before winning, you have to compete, right? And for us, it's just it's building it's building a roster of guys that want to be competitive. Uh, you just you can't you can't go out and play the game of basketball. I don't care where you're at in life. You can't go out to your job and not be competitive. You can't go on the basketball floor and not be competitive. You better like to freaking compete. Uh, and that's what our guy that's what our guys have to learn how to do. Uh, and if they're not going to be about that, it's going to be hard to be in Green Bay. That's just not what we're going to be about. So let's let's start with competing first and foremost. That's every single day that we step on this floor and we get in this community. Absolutely. Have you had a chance to meet with the team yet? And do you have a message for them? Uh, we had a brief Zoom. All right. We had a we had a brief Zoom when I got the job. I just wanted to let them know that uh, uh, these situations are unique. All right. It wasn't their dream to play for Coach Sundance Wicks. They signed with another staff. Uh, but we all have to be responsible for the situation that we're in. Uh, there, every player that was in that locker room was responsible for the situation that's happening right now. And so once we take ownership of that, I told them we can start to move forward. But if, we, if we're a little bit delusional and think that none of us are responsible for the situation that occurred, then uh, we got a long ways to go. So I think they felt that message. Uh, and they understood that if they don't match my energy every single day, uh, it's going to be a, it's going to be a tough mountain to climb. Absolutely. And I, and I know you, you talked a little bit about the community. Alumni just kind of building those relationships it's not only going to take the coaching staff and the players it's going to take the community and, and uh, the, the school and, and the boosters and the alumni everyone's going to be a part of this this is a storied program all right I, it, when you think about dick bennett i played for a coach who modeled our motion offense after dick bennett blocker mover um this is a storied program there's a lot of history and tradition here it has won every coach has won here right every coach has, has won here except for the last one and that's that's no knock it's just what it is it's a situation and so for us, it's to realize that, that history and tradition, honor that, connect the past players to our future players, uh, and then know, know how we go from there. Uh, I think you, to move forward, you have to be able to look back and say, how was this done before with Wardle, with Qualcheck, with Heidemann, with Bennett, uh, with Dave Buss. You look back at those history of those coaches, and you sit there and you go, it's an honor to be here. Uh, we just want to make sure that we do everybody proud. All right. Talking with Sundance Wicks, the new men's basketball coach here at Green Bay. I don't know about anyone else, Coach. I'm fired up. I'm ready to go play. <laughs> I'll tell you what. If, if, this, if this community can rally around our men's program like they rally around the women's program, and, and Coach Borseth has done a phenomenal job of building that, right, is this thing is going to be built, not bought. I mean, I know we're living in the NIL days, but we're going to build this program. We're not going to buy it. And so we're going to make sure we get the right kids in here with the right motives and the right intentions. We can't wait to see you get uh, your first practice and your first games next fall. Coach? Practices are open. Come on in. Check us out. We sure will. Yes, sir. Congratulations Thank on the you. new job, and we look forward to seeing you next season. You got it. All right.